The most effective way to improve your score in section one of the BMAT is through doing practice questions in papers. This allows you to get used to the style and types of question. To ensure maximum efficiency, it is recommended that you do the practice questions and papers in the time limit given, which is 60 minutes. This leaves just under two minutes per question, which can be difficult to achieve when first attempting these question types. Firstly, when identifying what information could strengthen or weaken the argument given, think about which statement would make the argument more or less believable from an objective perspective. Secondly, an assumption is a statement that is not said explicitly within the text, but is needed for the argument to work. To see whether something is an assumption, decide whether the argument would still be valid if the statement was false or incorrect. If the argument would not be valid, then it is likely that the statement is an assumption. Thirdly, when reading the passage, try and summarise what it is trying to tell you. This is often reflected in the conclusion and any intermediate conclusions. Keep in mind that the conclusion may also not be explicitly stated within the text. It is often inferring something based on the information provided. And lastly, the six-step approach to critical thinking. Unfortunately, this one's too good to share, but don't worry, attend a Blackstone Tutors intensive BMAT course and you will learn our trademark six-step approach to critical thinking questions, as well as receiving our 500-page BMAT resource guide. Firstly, read each question carefully before attempting to answer, for example by highlighting key information that the question provides. Secondly, for questions that require spatial awareness, use the question paper to draw out diagrams to better understand what is being asked. Thirdly, whilst the questions and answers vary from year to year, the types of problems, challenges and analytical techniques required from the students remain very similar. Hence, past papers are vital to improve your BMAT Section 1 score. And lastly, time-efficient techniques. Attend a Blackstone Tutors BMAT course and we'll teach you a range of time-efficient BMAT tips and techniques. In Section 1, it's important that you don't spend too long on any individual question due to the time constraints. Therefore, it is useful to skim through and prioritise the questions that you're confident in and then go back to the ones that you've missed. However, it must be stressed that all the questions should be answered as there is no negative marking. 